What's up guys, today we're gonna model in couple of towers from the castle and wall from the castle. So, select the cube by the left click, X delete, Shift A on the mesh at cylinder, SZ, you can rescale it a little bit in the Z axis, click tab to go to the edit mode, click 3 to the face selection, you wanna select this face above, E, S, and just move this down, yes, something like this. Now, you can select whatever face you want on this ring right here, hold Shift and select next face with the gap and hold and shift hold control and click on the numpad plus to select all those faces right here on this loop with the gap now click e to extrude this up and this already give me kind of tower look yes i'm gonna show a different shape of the tower so i'm gonna click tap shift d and gx move this aside because this is my base now i have this shape i'm gonna click tap to go to the edit mode and once again, 3 to the face selection. I can select this face inside, yes. E, S, and rescale it down a little bit. And I can select maybe this ring right here, yes. I'm gonna select this face, hold Shift Alt, and I'm gonna click on the edge right here on the face to select all the loop. And E, I can extrude this down. Now, I can select this face right here, E, and just move the mouse. I'm gonna show you Japanese kind of style of our. Uh, once again E has to extrude and E S I'm gonna just move this a little bit and I'm gonna make this face bigger than the tower yes something like this and E wait guys E and I'm just moving this up and S and as you can see this just gives me kind of Japanese kind of style of tower I'm gonna control Z this and once again E S I'm gonna rescale it maybe something like this and once again E to extrude this up and S and I have this kind of shape of the tower of course I cannot control error loop cut right here left click and just move this loop cut maybe down and S and I can reshape whatever shape I want yes maybe create this kind of Disney look to this tower or maybe this kind of shape i'm gonna show you the materials and later i'm gonna show you how to create wall from the castle if you like this content of course subscribe so i'm just clicking tap and on the blender kit i'm gonna tap right here make stone why not stone material and i'm gonna maybe add this material right here and on this tower too i'm gonna show you on the render view as you can see this looks like that yes i can add right here a different material is not like now I'm gonna go on the solid view and we're gonna model a wall from the castle so shift a on the mesh up of course cube and G X I'm gonna move this cube right here now S Z I'm gonna rescale it in the Z axis and S X in this X direction I'm gonna click tab to go to the edit mode and control R I want to add a couple of loop cuts right here, something like this, four or five loop cuts. I'm going to click three to the face selection and I'm going to just hold shift and select right here those faces with the gap, yes? And whatever faces you're going to select, different shape of the wall you're going to have. So I'm just selecting those faces and once again, E to extrude this up. And I can click tab to go to the object mode. I can select this part, go on the modifiers, and of course add array modifier right here. As you can see, I can add how many parts I want to this wall. Like I said, whatever faces you're gonna extrude up from this cube, you're gonna have different kind of uh, pattern on this right here, on this wall. And of course I can add different material, I'm gonna show you the material, and as you can see this is my wall from the castle. Of course, add good material because the geometry is not right here correctly done but you can create very simple wall and tower from cylinder from cube yes so if you like this content guys subscribe it's gonna help my channel uh, i record this very fast see you on the next video bye guys